Does it really right for a mother to leave their kit and travel out? Does it right? everybody welcome back to the quarter first lady tv channel if this is the first time you come across this channel please consider to subscribe put the post notification bell so that anytime i am online or drop video you will be the first person to, to notify thank you so much as you do so god bless you and to you my returning subscriber i said god bless you thank you for being here god bless you so much so guys the question is does it really right for a single mother or a mother to lead to leave their family and go out like travel because uh, for one thing of the other because my family are not feeding well because i don't i am not capable of taking care of my my children as an I am a woman. I need to support my husband or for the for the ones who are still in their marital home. Does it right for them to go out to work hard just because of their family, their children? Does it right? I mean, some people are not seeing it like like um how did I even put it? Reason why bringing up I am bringing up this topic today. I have heard a lot. They, they're not seeing it as an insult for you as a woman who has a child. And maybe in the environment where you are, you don't have money to take care of your children. And then you get job opportunity out there, which is only for you to travel, not, not meant for you and your family. And then you take that decision, you make that you, you make that stand that I want to go out there and work for my family. It now look as those people that do that do like that is now look as if they are people now make mockery on them like they leave their family and go out. Guys, if you grow if you brought up a child without education, even if, if that child grow, he or she will hurt you. I want to stay with my baby. I don't want to go out. I want to stay. I can't leave my children to go out. Or I can't let any woman bring up my children. And you are there. But you can't feed that your child. You get many opportunities to give to that your child. You did not give them. And at the end of the day, they will also grow and say they don't want to leave their family and still remain one place. That is why you are seeing some family are no are no progressing. They still remain where they are. This really touched my heart today, and I think to share it out there with you, my brothers and sisters, as you watch this video, you also leave a comment. To me, I feel like I have a kit. I want to take care of my kids. I want to take care of my family. And I don't have opportunity where I am, where I give back to them, to take care of them. Then I have opportunity where I can go out and work and then take care of them financially. I know you will not be there for them physically when you are out. But trust me, when you are making... When you are making a progress for those family lives, for those your children lives, you are making a progress. You are putting impact in them that tomorrow if they grow up, they will not lack. Like from example, now if your child grow and we're educated and have CV, have all opportunity to get a job. Maybe where you as a mother or as a father do not get that job, your child will get that job. Because why? They are qualified to be working in in so 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 company because they work they they, they 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 went for school for it they study they know what is mean, but if you stay you want to embrace your children every day you want to wake up every day to see your children and you can't put food on their table you can't close them very well you can't even uh, take care of their fees you are not a mother you are not a good mother this is my stand on this but you. Watching me right now, I beg you to leave your comment. 
if it is a wrong thing for a mother to leave her child with his family or with someone that she know that this person capable of taking care of my children i will leave my children with them and then go out there fight for my children future and then somebody will get up and say i am not like those who have uh, children they cannot stay in their marital home. guys let me tell you one thing a lot of people are making a big mistake yes a lot of people are making a big mistake i will say this and i will say it openly i don't know how you want to take it but i'm telling you the truth when you are in the marriage that you are working hard to make money nothing is working for it and your husband is working hard both of you are struggling to make money nothing is working work for it and then you see this job opportunity somewhere and you don't want to go because you don't want to lose your marriage you are not helping yourself you're not helping that your family you want to remain where you are no you watching me today tell me if i am wrong by 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 this point like i have job opportunity i have this opportunity out there i want to work and then earn this money and help my family and i don't want to go because it will look as if i don't love my family i i don't want to deny my children the opportunity opportunity of childhood <laughs> my dear don't even dare do that if you are that type of person okay i advise you today if you have a child and you have opportunity out there to take care of those children go and fight for your children future don't stay there and say eh, maybe my husband will get another wife if i left and eh, maybe people will laugh at me that is what is killing us people will laugh at me oh i don't want people to be talking about me i don't want this are you living your life for people can anyone put a cup of water in your table can anyone pay your child school fee yes if you have someone who can do that for you and ask you to stay in your husband's home stay there but if you do not have my dear brother my dear my dear sister run for your children future if you are you remain zero today don't pray for your children to remain like you are pray for them to be where you have never been that is the prayer of every mother so i don't see any reason where any any woman out there will stay there i am not those who have baby and leave it with their leave it with their family and run go out some people will even put it that you go out to do ashara ashara is personality i always talk about this on this my link is personality if you want to do it you can do it but if you tell yourself that i will not do it i will be who i am i am concentrating in working and end my money to help my family yes you can still do it so for those of you who said uh, they will just stay there, they will use their phone and call you and beg you for money. And then you send that money for them. They will still sit down there and condemn you. I, uh, me, I cannot leave my family and go out. Oh, but you did the year to year. You have been begging for money. Did they cost you? Are you cost? Can't you work and help somebody? Work and help others don't stay they be receiving then you, you, you when you go to the organization like you go to party or any other place you'll be you'll be making mouth ah those one they don't run leave house eh, because they want to take care of their children uh, eh, because they they go there to do a shara you call them so many bad names which is so unthinkable but right you will call them again and beg for them to use that money and give you i said may god punish you for that kind of person who who has that mind you think you are cheating on him and you are not cheating on him and you are cheating on yourself you don't want to be a single mother you don't want people to make mockery of you leave single mother alone yes leave single mother alone don't beg them for any help because them they want to to run for their children future they now become ashara they become irresponsible but you that you are responsible you are there still begging shame on you oh yes this is what i want to talk to single mother out there who are staying there some some of them they, they are still in their husband house and they don't want to do something to impact in their family they just stay there some of you are putting this fire on your husband you must do this or but you can't think of what to do to help yourself are you a woman what kind of a woman are you and the one that even killed me the most they will be gossiping those who take the risk to help their family what are you gossiping about who are you
are you perfect? The one that lived that trying so hard to help their family that you are not calling her a pro Ashara. Sorry for this language, it's not allowed here. You are not calling them Ashara. Are you better than that? Don't you know that even as a marriage woman that you claim to stay in your husband's house, sometimes that poverty will push you to sleep with your husband friend to make money. What are you saying? When you see opportunity, I came to clarify you today. If you see opportunity to work and help yourself, grab that opportunity. If you stay with a child, grow, brought up a child, and you don't give those, those children meaning to respect you, they will not respect you. They will even look at you. Maybe tomorrow night you see another person's child. Speak good English, dressing very good, driving a good car. You say, ah, you are not like that. The child will tell you, why can't you treat me to be like, why can't you train me to be like that? You will receive a lot of insult. I came today to tell you, mother, who shamelessly stayed there in your, in your husband's house and claiming that you want to be a decent woman, you want to be a saint. And then you see another woman. Maybe their marriage is not good and they decide to leave and leave their children with their parents or leave their children with their friends who care for them. Then you will be now gossiping here and there, gossiping here and there, shame on you. And then at the end, you will back off and call that person and beg for money. If the person even send that money for you, you eat costs. So as a mother, I advise you this evening, stand off on your ground. This this our generation, it is not the generation that will leave everything for men. Uh, my husband this, my husband that. If you marry, you don't have any uh, help, any support for your marriage. You are nothing. Some of you now, you become a single mother because... When you are, you are in your husband marriage, you don't handle your marriage well. You, are, you, all, you, you just want to be a liability, liability to your family, to your husband, and they can't bear it. They take another woman and you run away and you will become and gossiping those who, who they are on no good. They just live to take care of their family. What are you? I am warning you, watching me, if you are such person, repent today. Stop mockery, make mockery on, on people. Stop make people to feel disgrace you are ashamed of their decisions they make in life if your own will not help you their own will help them stop make people feel bad okay that is the me message for today please guys if you come across my channel for the first time subscribe to this channel you are supporting me with your one subscriber thank you as you do so and to my returning subscriber who are always here view my video i say god bless you thank you so much see you on my next video please help me share this video to reach the the the, the single mother out there who who pretend who claim to be with their children brought up their children in the respectful respectful way any child who want to be respect no matter how even on phone you call that child put them through talk to them even the person that they stay with they will become a good and responsible children don't think that because you want to stay there to caution your children to 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 as in take care of them by yourself before they can be who god want them to be yeah, we know that it is a good, it is good thing. It is a good thing for a mother to grow with their, their, their children for that feelings, for that care. But hey, if your own do not accept it, don't kill yourself because you want to stay there and nurture your children by yourself. As the end of the day, you will all end up um, brought in, brought up an illiterate. No, try hard to walk your children in the classic way. Where you have not been, pray for them to be there. This is the message for today, guys. I love you so much. Bye.